Have you ever thought about experiencing an old-fashioned Christmas? Well, stick around. That's what we're going to talk about next. Hi, I'm Kathleen with the Militello Team Realtor with Jay Barrett & Company. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Let's get started. Every year, the Cranes Estate gets decorated beautifully for Christmas. It's an annual event and it's called an Old Fashioned Christmas at Castle Hill. Just a brief overview. Richard T. and Florence Crane purchased land in Ipswich, Massachusetts, now known as Castle Hill. They built themselves a beautiful mansion. This house has 59 rooms and 39,000 square feet of living space. Can you imagine that? The home was donated to the trustees of reservations. Now the trustees are the ones who do the annual Christmas event of decorating the house for Christmas. They invite all the local florists and businesses in and they bid on decorating each one of the rooms that are available for showing. Not all the rooms are available, but the ones that are, are decorated for a beautiful Christmas event. As we enter through the front door, we enter into the gallery. This is a very long reception area. Take a look at this picture. And what is so unique about this, there is an alley that is you can see through the back window, and that's a half mile long stretch of grassy area that leads down to the sea. And then as we walk towards our right and down the hall, we enter into this huge rondelet, a circular room with a Renaissance painting on the ceiling. Unfortunately, I didn't capture the ceiling, but this is the rondelet. Then, off the rondelet, towards the back of the house, is the library. This is such a beautiful room with all of its fine woodwork. So just take a look at that. And then on the right side of the rondelet is what was previously known as the Crane's living room. This room is so huge. This is where they hold all of the balls that they have up there at the mansion. Now we need to walk down the hall to the left side and through the gallery and we come upon the beautiful staircase. And to the right is the grand dining room. Can you imagine serving a family in this dining room? It is absolutely gorgeous. The china is beautiful and the room is so big. And off to the left of the dining room is the butler's pantry. I didn't capture a picture of that because there were so many people in there drinking cider and eating cookies from Santa Claus. As we move up the stairs, we come to Cornelius Crane, the son of Florence and Richard, and he had his own suite. And within that suite, there's this little porch area where they could remove all of the glass and so bringing the outside into the inside. And Cornelius would love to sleep out there at night and look at the grand views of the ocean. The next room is the Oak Guest Room. Can you understand why? Then there's the Apricot Suite. This is where when they do weddings at the castle, you can use this room as the bride's suite. And then the second floor bay, that is the room that was used to accommodate any of the guests that came to visit the cranes. And that's where they would sit as their personalized living room area. And this is where I saw Santa Claus. Just check this out, Santa Claus. <laughs> And this is Mrs. Crane's suite. And then we have the Chinese guest room, which is called that because the original paper there was imported from China. That paper has been since removed and resold for another
other estate. This is Florence's suite. It's similar to Cornelius's, and she too has gorgeous ocean views. Lastly, we have Mr. Crane's suite. Just check out all the bathrooms in this house. They're just so gorgeous, and that's why, because he manufactured plumbing fixtures for the bathrooms. And then off of Mr. Crane's suite, we have the family sitting room. This was the informal room where the family would go to gather. Well, that's it for the old-fashioned Christmas at Castle Hill at the Crane Estate. And I will see you on the next one. But in the meantime, please subscribe to my channel and click the like button and give me any comments you may have regarding this video or what you'd like to see in the future. I've attached a link below to the Castle Hill website just in case you want to call them and arrange to have your wedding there. Until the next time, I'm Kathleen.